Thank you. Nice to meet you. So, how, uh, what are your key, key takeaways from the session? I think uh, it was very, um, it was very interesting takeaway. Um, I think we've learned multi-industry about what happens with different forms of um, specialists and and uh, you know industry leaders coming together and putting their thoughts together to find solutions on the metaverse. The metaverse is of course uh, uh, something that is ever developing, and uh, we are found we are we are basically looking at at how how to understand it, how to improve it, and how best to come forward uh, with a solution that is interoperable with um, with greater uh, uh, convenience, efficiency, sustainability, as well as um, technical uh, and um, security uh, to each individual user. I think that's where we've come forward. I think we've learned much. We've learned about e-commerce. We've learned about uh, blockchain we've learned about artificial intelligence i think it's a great it's a great platform thank you it's a so, it's a lovely event so how web3 is evolving in india and how, what are the roadblocks in the journey i think web3 is uh, is definitely evolving slowly but surely we have uh, much to learn i think uh, if if we look at in india we have the potential and the talent to uh, to service this great um, opportunity. Uh, uh, there's a lot of talent in India where blockchain and, and IT and, and services sector uh, can can provide the backbone of this industry. It's a trillion dollar in industry and I think uh, India is well po poised to, to push forward and lead the world on it. I think we, we have great potential. Sir, what are your like uh, expectations with the Web3 as far as market size is concerned in India? Sorry, what are you? Uh, what are your expectations with the market size in India? Like as you mentioned, it is one trillion right now. So where do you foresee it in after the ten after this I, decade? I think it's very difficult to say where where one can foresee it. I think uh, what's going to happen is uh, once regulatory frameworks are in place, uh, security standards are set, uh, international understanding is is built out. Um, there will be much further and faster acceleration of this. Uh, development in technology. Uh, I think what we're doing is we're at the tip of it right now. We must um, we must look at uh, the the enormous opportunity ahead of us and and tackle it with uh, with many many facets. Uh, we must understand individual requirements. We must understand uh, uh, government requirements. We must understand corporate and industry requirements. But most importantly, I think this will affect. Um, uh, corporate social responsibility, it will affect uh, education, it will affect infrastructure, it will affect every industry that is connected, in fact manufacturing as well as uh, as well as uh, you know um, uh, financial sectors. So it's a great it's a great uh, beginning uh, and I think we will uh, soon see much progress in the next few years. Thank you. As we know that uh, Web 3.0 is more or is it decentralized? I'm not sure. Yes. Is decentralized. So how how like what are the roadblocks as far as uh, government sides of it concern and the startups and consumers? I think the 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 startup economy and the started startup environment in India is very vibrant. There is uh, a lot of people who are trying to push the boundaries here. But um, as a regulatory body, I think um, um, what will happen is that. We have to tread cautiously. We have to be, we have to be sure-footed, and we have to go forward thinking about the privacy, the safety, and the and the security of people, uh, their assets, their intellectual properties, their their um, investments. So I think it's a good thing to be precautionary. We will be able to uh, be safe and secure in that system. Uh, there are many countries leading uh, the race, and we must uh, learn. India's uh, digital um, digital uh, developers has been fantastic, and I think we will uh, definitely be able to push forward and and um, bring uh, a lot to bear on these uh, on this business opportunities of the metaverse.